Hey, welcome back to Maya's Perla Reviews. And I'm reviewing Wedding Crasher and Taken 3. So let's get started with these reviews. Elephants upstairs, I tell you. So, anyways, Taken 3 is about. Liam um, Neeson, his character, I don't remember his character's name. It's not John. Well, anyways, his character. We find out that he's divorced and uh, his ex-wife is mar married to this one guy. Which, apparently, he owes a debt to a drug dealer. Someone kills his ex-wife because he was going to leave her current husband for Liam Neeson and she gets killed and people th um, think that uh, Liam Neeson killed her because she was inside his house. So, premises of it, he, he they're trying to capture him but he's trying to prove his innocence saying that he didn't kill his ex-wife and he's trying to find the answers to what happened Ex can't really give too much away um because it's new Because, um, it's 2013, I believe? 13, 14? Either or. So, I enjoyed this, this film. And I thought it was better than the second one. I didn't care for the second one. But I enjoyed the third one. I'm kind of looking forward to seeing the, the prequel, like, TV show. I like look forward to seeing that and see how it goes. If it's gonna follow the the these, this trilogy or like lead up to it. Excuse me. And yeah, I give it a ten out of ten. Thought it interesting and better than the second one so I would recommend it if you guys haven't checked it out you should totally check it out I know the movie Phantom does not like the Takens but I pretty I like them I thought they're pretty good so yeah next is Wedding Crasher Wedding Crasher is Owen Wilson and Vince Vaughn Yeah, they decide to crash weddings, pretend that they're part of the family of the wedding, and hook up with these random girls and have sex with them. Which, like, they go to this very last wedding. They go to the wedding. They stayed for like, uh, and their their family spend time with the family and such and one of the guys uh, calls up one of his friends and asks them to look these guys up because there's something fishy about them so yeah and they find out who they are and then they stop doing wedding crashing weddings but Vince Vaughn did not um crash any more weddings after that because he fell in love with 
one of the the girls at the wedding and so did Owen Wilson but Owen Wilson's um, girl she played Regina George and um Mean Girls yeah Julia Roberts. No. I don't remember what her name is. But her name was Gloria. And they both fall in love with these girls. Vince Vaughn uh, gets married to his girl. But Owen Wilson doesn't. But he explains why he did this and and such yeah why he did it he told um, Gloria why he did it and they end up getting it giving each other a second chance and yeah that's it that's about it for this that movie I enjoyed it there's a lot of funny stuff happening I like how Vince Vaughn's a girl was like all like crazy and clingy and and he thought she was a virgin and he he told the pre preacher about it and the preacher told the family and things went all crazy for a bit yeah I enjoy, enjoy this movie I think Owen Wilson and Miss Vaughn were good roles for this movie because they're hilarious. And yeah, I think that's about it. And the the the, the grandma on it, she was hilarious. I like how she's like, look, it's all sweet and, and nice, and then. She's all like a, a bitch, like asshole, and such. So, I, if you guys check these movies out, you should totally check them out. I give this one, let's see. Ah, same as the last one. 10 out of 10, because I really enjoyed both of these movies. And I hope you guys like this review. And if you haven't liked, if you like it, like it. If you have subscribed, subscribe. And you can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. So, I hope you guys see you on the next video. And I'll catch you guys later.